Once upon a time, in a small town nestled between rolling hills and lush forests, there stood a quaint and mysterious toy shop known as Mr. Willow's Magic Toy Shop. Its wooden exterior was adorned with intricate carvings of playful animals and whimsical fairies, and a warm glow emanated from the window, beckoning curious souls inside. One magical evening, as the golden sun dipped below the horizon, a pair of siblings named Jack and Lucy strolled hand in hand down the cobbled streets. Their eyes sparkled with wonder and anticipation as they approached the mystical toy shop, drawn by the enchanting melody that seemed to emanate from its very walls. As they pushed open the creaky door, a tinkling bell announced their arrival, and they were greeted by a sight that took their breath away. The interior was a treasure trove of toys, each one more captivating than the last. Dolls with eyes that twinkled like stars, miniature wooden carriages that rolled on their own and animals that seemed to move with a life of their own. At the heart of the shop stood the enigmatic Mr. Willow, a kind old man with a long, flowing beard and bright, twinkling eyes. He wore a weathered hat adorned with feathers, hinting at the adventures he had once embarked upon. Welcome young travelers, Mr. Willow greeted them with a warm smile. I see the glimmer of magic in your eyes. Curiosity bubbled within Jack and Lucy and they couldn't help but ask, what makes these toys enchanted? Mr. Willow chuckled softly, a sound that carried a touch of mystery. Ah, each toy has a dash of magic in it. When the moonlight kisses them goodnight, they come alive, embarking on adventures of their own. Eager to witness the magic, Jack and Lucy began exploring the shop, their hearts full of delight. Suddenly, as if by an unseen cue, a group of toys came to life. There was a jolly clown whose laughter filled the air, a wise owl who bestowed wisdom upon all who listened, a brave knight standing tall and proud, a graceful ballerina who twirled with ethereal beauty, and a mischievous teddy bear that radiated warmth and comfort. Hello, young ones. Welcome to our toy shop, the clown beamed. A pleasure indeed, the owl chimed in, nodding wisely. I am Sir Galahad, the bravest knight in the kingdom declared the knight, striking a pose. I am Arabella, a dancer of dreams, said the ballerina, gracefully curtsying. I'm Teddy, and I love hugs, chuckled the teddy bear, extending its soft arms. Jack and Lucy couldn't believe their eyes as they played with the animated toys. The clown taught them tricks, the owl shared fascinating tales of faraway lands, the knight valiantly protected them from imaginary foes and the ballerina danced with grace that seemed to defy gravity. The clown taught them tricks, the owl shared fascinating tales of faraway lands, the knight valiantly protected them from imaginary foes, and the ballerina danced with grace that seemed to defy gravity. It's time for us to rest, dear friends, said the clown, looking at the siblings with a twinkle in its eye. But fret not, for tomorrow night, we shall awaken again to play with you. As Jack and Lucy bid their new toy friends goodbye they couldn't help but feel a tinge of excitement for the next night's adventures. They promised Mr. Willow they would return, eager to explore more enchantment in the embrace of the moonlit toy shop. And so, every night after, Jack and Lucy found themselves venturing back to Mr. Willow's enchanted toy shop, where the magic of childhood thrived, and where cherished memories were woven with the threads of imagination and wonder. They learned that when you open your heart to the mysteries of the world, it reveals its magic, and the most extraordinary adventures await those who dare to dream. And so, the enchanting tale of Mr. Willow's enchanted toy shop continues to this day, a beacon of wonder for all who seek the magic hidden in the ordinary.